G'day. Welcome to Chuck Chases the Facts, where we look at strange things on the internet and YouTube. Yesterday was the day that possibly, potentially, could have put us all out of a job. Uh, I say all of us when I refer to my list of names uh, in no particular order and uh, I'm sure there are more but I'm talking predominantly about uh, Call Hard Logic, Simon Dan, Conspiracy Cats, Fight the Flat Earth, Planner Walk, Team Skeptic, Mr. Sensible and Demonic Davros to name but a very few. With the break off of D28 from the Antarctic Circle, has what I kind of personally believe has completely debunked the flat earth theory. It's prompted me to make this video. Um, two in two days, which I've never done before. And I've also done it with no script, so I'm gonna waffle on a little bit. Let's take a look at this video. It's from Sky News. Um, have a little look at it. <clears throat> and we'll talk about it in a second. What a beautiful piece of footage. That scenery is just absolutely gorgeous. Um, I've watched it a few times and it's, I still find it breathtaking. So a few facts about uh, D28. It broke away yesterday. Um, scientists have been watching it for, I think they said about 19 years and they predicted that it would break away somewhere between 2010 and 2015 but obviously it broke away yesterday uh, so a couple of facts it is uh, 1636 squared kilometers it weighs uh, 315 billion tons um, Depending on which news uh, news source you uh, read or watch, it is the size of Sydney. Uh, it's also the size of London, the size of New York, and also the size of the Isle of Skye, which is the island off uh, the north of Scotland. Um, it is a natural occurrence. Uh, I think the last one happened in nineteen six in the sixties or seventies. I was reading, and also to quote news, uh, Sky News, 
losing bergs to the ocean is how the ice streams maintain equilibrium. So there is absolutely no question of this incident being, um, what's the word, being attributed to climate change. It's something that just happens naturally. But what I wanted to focus on was the footage on that video. The flat earthers believe that the Antarctic is the ice wall around their stupid little um, circular planet or circular disk. Did anybody see the fact that the sea continued around uh, the Antarctic? They claim that this wall of ice that protects their silly little disk um, is approximately, um, I think they claim it to be two kilometers tall. Um, D28 that broke away was, I don't know why I'm doing that, that's not the right size, but D28 was, is 210 meters thick, not two kilometers, as uh, Flat Earthers claim. And as the image, I don't know if it was a drone or a helicopter, but as the image sort of panned around, you could see right across the um, the snow there or the ice does that fall in line with the flat earth theory um, and the fact that you could see land in the distance at one, at one of the shots where it came round you could see land in the distance um, but the main thing I noticed and bear me a second I'm on middle middle break middle rest day the biggest thing that i noticed or what i didn't notice was that as the camera first started and um, about i think it's about 20 30 seconds in it sort of pans around and you can see the ocean the ocean opens up completely where are the ice wall guards? Where are all the boats that are supposed to be guarding the ice wall? So that one minute, 10 second video clip for me, I was going to say debunks the flat earth, but the flat earth doesn't exist anyway. But there's a lot of images just on that one minute 10 clip that completely throw out the flat earth theory. So Nathan, Mark, uh, what's the other one? Bob drift a 15 degree per hour drift but sorry guys this natural occurrence that happened just happened to happen yesterday has completely screwed your theory of a flat tarred earth sorry guys um, for all those channels I mentioned I'll pop a link in the description below brilliant channels i'm subscribed to them all um just on flat earth with me personally i'm not a scientific well i like science but i'm not a scientific guy i've got no degrees i've got no education in science or astronomy or physics mathematics or anything like that i did get an o level in maths quite some time ago i won't give you the year so I will try and 
I'm going to jump on board with this uh, debunking. Um, I'm a great researcher. Uh, I can research anything and I will back it up. Um, if there's something I see and I can't fully describe it, I'm going to ask one of these guys to um, give me the, the rundown or ask them to do a quick video. Um, but I think these guys need exposing, debunking, um, getting rid of. In fact, here's an idea. Here's a great idea. Why don't we round up the Flat Earthers? Oh, I may have the name of another one then. There's another Nathan. Why don't we round them up and stick them on D28 and see where they end up? That ice, that iceberg might uh, float all around the world before it dissolves. It's going to take years to dissolve, apparently. But, um, yeah, that's it. I, I just wanted to make this video because I think we're all out of a job. The flat earth has been completely debunked by this natural occurrence. Um, but hey, we'll press on and just show these show these fools up for the idiots that they totally are. Okay, that's all I've got. Bit of a rant, um, no script. <laughs> Um, but that was good fun. I enjoyed that. If you did like it, like and subscribe, click the bell, comments below. Um, and someone, uh, oh geez, what was his name? Jason. Jason, thank you for your comment. A great idea. It's going to take some work. Need to put a lot of videos together for that one, but I think you've got something there. I'm going to look at that. Probably not the next video. But watch this space. Alright. Thanks guys. Have a great uh, evening here in uh, Australia. Have a great day in America and England. Thanks guys. Good night.